Hello guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss the last year interview questions of IRS entrance exam which are asked in 2021 for the courses of MSc and MTech admissions. As if we know, the notification for 2022-24 academic year is live now for IRS. The last date for application is 31st March 2022. So let's find out the last year interview questions asked in these examinations. If you are new to our YouTube channel, please don't forget to subscribe our channel as well as to share this video who are interested to carve their future in geoinformatics and remote sensing. So we will start with MSc interview questions. Before starting the interview, if you want to know what is IRS, what are the courses it's offer, what is free structure, after that eligibility, then what are the scope, then don't forget to watch our previous video which are based on the scope of agricultural graduates in ISRO. The video is given in description box, video link, so don't forget. We will start now for interview questions for MSc degree which is in Geoinformatics sector offered by IRS. Also the Geoinformatics degree of MSc is affiliated with Netherlands University, 20 University and the candidates has to perform 6 month project in Netherlands. So it is a great opportunity for candidates who pursuing the MSc degree to be uh, get a global exposure so guys these are some questions we will start now the candidate was agriculture background having agriculture background and appeared for this interview and successfully selected for the course what is the morphometric analysis so first question was related to his degree then what do you mean by remote sensing the basic question of remote sensing and how we can define the remote sensing tell some satellites launched by India again it was general knowledge question what are the satellites launched by India the panel has been asked what is the hydrological modeling the hydrological modeling is the performing the run for run for runoff or rainfall factors for designing any construction work is called hydrological modeling what is the effect of crop water requirement is there any increase in temperature so guys the crop water requirement which is the part of irrigation engineering which was the background of the candidate appearing for interview as well as the topic which is mostly used in remote sensing to observe agriculture field has been asked. So what do you mean by empirical model? The empirical models are theoretical models to describe any performing efficiency or empirical formulas. What do you mean by DEM and where we can download it? So it is the GIS related basic question which you will definitely get by your basic knowledge of remote sensing what is mean by evaporation tell me some methods of its measurement so evaporation is uh, draining of vapor from water body and tells a method of its measurement so there are so many methods like pan evaporimeter then lysimeter etc etc some various methods again the defined watershed it is also part of soil water conservation engineering the watershed is had single hydrological unit having single outlet and then some geomorphological characteristics of watershed. So, if we consider these uh, interview questions, you will find that the question asked on agriculture, agriculture allied engineering, and basic remote sensing. So, on your degree base and the basic knowledge of remote sensing, the question were asked. Now we will turn the MTech interview questions. There are six to seven specializations in MTech. While MSc has only one specialization in IRS, so for MTech we will see what questions were panel asked. For candidate 1, what is crop coefficient? Again related to agriculture which was background of 
the student what do you mean by the remote sensing the basic question repeated here again what is actual evapotranspiration what is potential evapotranspiration what is reference evapotranspiration and what is hydrological modeling again the case questions were repeated because the candidate who appeared for mtech also from agriculture engineering background he has to study irrigation engineering soil water conservation engineering so these questions has been asked on his degree and also these points are to be calculated in remote sensing and gis so this matters for the interview conducting panel and they assume you you should know this basic again what is transpiration what is the reason behind the green color of grass so here photosynthesis should be explained which soil is found in your area it is student specific question one may say laterite red soil or black soil black cotton soil and according to you have to define or give explanation to the panel which type of climate found in your area again the student dependent question it may may vary from person to person but you should know the basic about your area so panel asking and realizing how much the candidate know about his area and uh, applying his degree if you are chemical engineer they might ask uh, how many chemical factories or what is the manufacturing hub of your area etc so here the student has been asked for his soil type his climate then topography etc which type of soil found in semi arid zones again the agriculture related question what is topography of your area <laughs> as i have discussed earlier the same question has been asked topography of the area of the student is discussed then next question was tell me something about hydrograph so hydrograph is uh, representation of runoff versus time so what are the discharge measurement structures again the irrigation engineering question has been asked scs and cn method again curve number method to measure the runoff then evapotranspiration constructive use rate and evaporation these were some basic agricultural and irrigation soil water conservation engineering questions asked in the interview panel again guys we will see the questions asked to candidate second first question was the what is the wilting point so wilting point is the ultimate pressure ultimate low pressure at which the water is not available to or we can say the plant is not uh, able to harness the water and it uh, tends to die so it is the water pressure in the soil what are the greenhouse exhaust gases very common and general knowledge question exhaust gases greenhouse what is evapotranspiration sorry evaporation and its formula so what is how we can measure evaporation with using formulas like penman formula or any etc we have to discuss here then annual rainfall of your area uh, the candidate has been asked what is rainfall of his area and the annual rainfall of india so 1194 mm is the annual rainfall of india average and rainfall then what is the principle of survey very basic question from its uh, degree background the survey was the basic uh, uh, with basic objective to plan design and develop any uh, particular area so it has been uh, should be discussed there with the panel then why are you interested in remote sensing and gis so guys if you are applying for this interview you should know why you are interested in this course what are the basics of this course and you should know what are the application scope and general current affairs regarding these courses what is your future plan in the field of remote sensing and gis again the student oriented question asked so to judge his perspective in this field what is texture what is structure of soil so soil related questions again here repeated the basic fundamental properties of soil that is texture and structure has been discussed how many types of textures are there so you have to describe how many textures of soil are there And then what is hydraulic conductivity the rate of flow of water from one medium to another medium of soil it is called hydraulic conductivity which is measured in mm per hour or uh, unit area so it ha you have to describe it with uh, your perception can you give numerical formula for the hydraulic conductivity of soil 
yes we can provide some numerical formulas which are already available with us which are defined by some scientists but you, it should be you know what is the plane table survey and tell about traverse survey this was basics from soil water conservation engineering so guys this was this was some questions asked in this winter view you will find the panel was focused on three four things first you know the basic of remote sensing and gis second thing you should know basic of your degree then third thing if you are applying for agriculture etc uh, specialization in mtech and msc then you should know its uh, basics soil soil conservation and irrigation third one was you should aware of current affairs or what is going on in the field of remote sensing and gis so to be successful in this interview we wish you best of luck if you are applying for this msc and mtech program as well as post graduation diploma programs then the last date for application in this year is 31st march don't miss the chance to be part of this wonderful institute irs indian institute of remote sensing to get detail of this institute don't miss our video previously added on this topic thank you